Hey everybody, what's going on? This week on One Solo Week Guy, we're going to be starting a new segment, and that segment's going to be called Basics for the Trade Workers, and of course, this week's segment's going to be based off belts, because we all know how important belts are. So if you're new to the channel, we take a look at tools every week, so if you love tools, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Let's get to it. Hey everybody, what's going on? Thanks for tuning in to another video of One Tool A Week. If you're new to the channel, we take a look at tools every week. So if you love tools, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. So what is it that we're going to be taking a look at this week? Well, we're going to start a new segment, guys, and I've been wanting to do this because I haven't really seen it out on the channel. So we're going to go ahead and get this new stage uh, going on, and that's going to be the new setup is going to be the basics for the trades workers. And, of course, uh, that's going to consist of clothing and stuff that you're going to wear every day. So our first uh, segment is going to be based off belts, guys. So I know it's um, something that y'all really don't consider you put on a belt but it's pretty much something very essential that you're going to need as far as being in the trade you go anywhere more than likely somebody's gonna have a belt if not they're gonna loop around some string rope uh, uh solder something just to keep those pants from falling down from all the weight that you carry if it's some tongue and groove pliers uh your 11 and 1 screwdriver um channel locks your nipix whatever the case is guys you're going to be carrying a bunch of stuff with you so with that being said guys the first belt that we're going to be taking a look at is this now this is going to be the core belt essentials right here and let's go ahead and zoom in and this is going to be the baby that we're going to be taking a look at now the core essentials uh track belt is going to be this is going to be the their express alloy which is this buckle right here that you could see and of course on Amazon, you're going to be able to get it for $49.95. So that's going to be the price of this one. Now, one size, they only have it in one size as far as their regular belts right here. And that one size is going to fit 24 inches or all the way to 44 inches, which is a good amount. And it is going to be uh, just... Uh, that's going to be the only sizes that they're going to have. Now, the width on the belt itself is going to be one, one and three-eighths of an inch wide. And, of course, they're going to have it in black, brown, and tan, which is a, and it's going to come in this smooth leather style right here. Now, what's cool about it, uh, if you see right here, let's go ahead and open this up. You're going to see that it does not have any holes on it. And the reason is because they have this patent uh, track system right here that you could see. And in Instead of going through holes, it's going to have a track system. Let's go ahead and zoom in. So you can see these little groove notches right there where the actual belt uh, catches right here. Now, the cool thing about it is instead of having holes all around, which is going to be either a quarter of an inch or uh, every so further, uh, you're going to have these increments every quarter of an inch. And those increments are going to be a total of... 43 adjustments that you could do so from the beginning right here all the way to the end of over here You're going to have 43 adjustments that you could adjust your belt now if you hear it right here You're gonna have a nice little latch. Let me see if the camera catches right here Let me zoom out a tad bit and let the camera focus. So if you see right here, you're gonna have a nice little latch Which opens up and closes let me zoom into it again and if you see it right here the latch it opens up and closes now you're gonna hear it click in there and let's go ahead and put that right in here and you could just hear the track going now let's say you eat a heavy lunch or it's friday and y'all decide to go somewhere nice for lunch all you got to do to loosen up your pants right here is going to be clip this right in and it lifts up the lever and it pulls it right out so you don't have to be uh, undoing the section right here and then pulling going to the next hole no it just adjusts really quick and just really fast so as you can tell i've used this baby for a good amount now how long have i had it this one by itself i've had it for about two years i've had it since june and this is the wear and tear that it has let's go ahead and open it up you can see some scruffs right there where it's been scratched all around and of course all it does is you open up these teeth right here and you can replace the belt right here so as you can see the teeth have eaten right into the leather but of course it's yet to go bad i'm still been using it and again it is pretty great belt that i've been using now as you can see it does have wear and tear um you can see where the leather's coming apart on this side 
right here. But again, it is still working. It's still great. I haven't uh, had any issues with it. Now, one thing that I do love about it is that it doesn't stretch out. So for all those uh, leather belts that have holes, you end up stretching it. That is pretty neat. So let me go ahead and open this up. I went ahead and purchased a new one. Uh, just the belt by itself, not the buckle. So as you can see, it comes with this little uh, section right here and instructions how to use it. And you go ahead and pull it out. And of course, let's pull it out. And of course, course I went ahead and purchased the black one so as you can see this is the the belt that it's gonna come with and this is the black section which is very nice guys I've been using it again for a while and all you do is just size it up to whatever sizes you're gonna need you cut the leather and you go ahead and set it up for that one so that was the little box that it comes with now if you want something more heavier and stronger than just the leather belt if you're gonna be carrying a good amount for all you people that are uh, EDC or carry uh, have a license to carry um, then you might want to take a look at their gun collection which is going to be this baby right here let's go ahead and open this up right here and this is going to be the black tactical gun belt by x5 and of course black buckle so as you can see it open it up same instructions right here and it's just going to come with a couple more things right here now this is going to be their core tactical belt uh it's going to be two times stiffer than their leather uh belt buckle so let's go ahead and open this up and as you can see it is this baby right here this is the black that i went ahead and got and again it's gonna have their track system right back here as you can see and of course the adjustments quarter inch increments now you are gonna get this uh, buckle right here that's gonna go and you're gonna have this little uh, section that it's gonna hold the end of the belt for you that way it stays stiff against your waist right there so there we go and of course it's gonna come with some screws and some allen keys which I'll show you what they're for right now let's go ahead and move this to the side throw that box to the side now of course it is going to be a gun belt guys um you're going to be able to carry a uh, concealed carry or if you're out in duty and you want to go ahead and carry your stuff you are going to be able to carry and it's going to stay stiff up to eight pounds of loaded rating for this section right here or this belt now of course it is going to be inch and a half wide right here and the sizes that it's going to end up fitting is going to be a 24 to 54 inches uh, that you're gonna be able to fit them now of course the belt and again it's going to come with this belt keeper right here that you go ahead and put it at the end and let's go ahead and put this section together so what you're gonna do again it has the sizes in here let me see if we could zoom into it, this section you're gonna be able to see all the sizes that you're able to cut it and after you cut it and you read the instructions it's gonna tell you how much you need for your gun belt and, or your carrying your gun that you're going to be carrying and you're going to be able to cut it so what you're going to end up doing is you're going to be opening up this latch right here and once you open it you're going to unscrew these screws right here with the allen key now once you get the screws all the way out you go ahead and set the belts in and you're going to see it line up all the way to the end you wherever you cut it you're going to want to cut it straight and after that you go ahead and you clip it down it's going to latch then you tighten up the screws again. And there you have it, guys. That's going to be your belt. As you can see, it's nice and stiff and it's going to catch. And all you do is just the same way. You throw it in and you could hear it just catching and grabbing. So once you have it there, uh, you're going to go ahead and put the loop right back over here. That way it catches your belt and it catches to the side and keeps it against your waist, which is a very nice feature, guys. Again, this is going to be their gun belt right here for core essentials. And, of course, it's going to set you back for $59.95. So, on Amazon, you're going to be able to find it. Let's go ahead and put this to the side. Now, next up, guys, is going to be another type of belt that, in case you didn't like any of the core belts that you're going to have, it's going to be another suggestion that I'm, I went ahead and purchased just because I wanted to try it out and see what the fuss was about. So, of course, guys, if you're wondering why I'm doing a segment about belts, the belt keep your pants 
on you that way you don't end up falling and of course your pants keep a lot of things that you're going to be carrying out in the trade so a belt is a very important part to your uh everyday carry or your edc on you all the time and of course that other belt's going to be this baby right here that i went ahead and picked up now this is going to be the groove lives groove belt right here and let's go ahead this is the packaging that it came in and let's go ahead and open up this baby cool throw that to the side and of course you got to register your product that way uh you go ahead and activate the warranty now the cool thing about this guys uh groove life uh is going to give you a they're going to be giving you a 94 year warranty and that's pretty neat but of course you got to register it and that warranty is going to be uh no no bs and of course it's going to be any uh breaks on it tears if the belt loosens up whatever you got Whatever that ends up happening, it's going to go ahead and cover it up. Now, of course, you're going to have a little loop right here. That way it keeps your belt. And let's go ahead and bring this baby out. So as you can see right here, this is going to be it. Now, you do have a little bit of stretchiness, uh, not too much. Uh, that way you're nice and comfortable in the trade. And, of course, uh, this is going to be their uh, metal and deep stone finish right here. Now, of course, it's going to be an aluminum buckle that you could see right there. And let me see if I could zoom out. And this is going to be the product. Now, of course, on Amazon, you're going to be able to find it for $59.95. I was trying to uh, see if they had any uh, weight uh, weight ratings on there. That way I could see if you could have have a concealed carry or have uh anything like that as far as on the belt but i couldn't find anything but i did find on the comments that a bunch of people use it for that purpose and they haven't had any issues with it now besides the gunmetal they carry all kinds of buckles of course the buckle is going to be aluminum now the sizing for that is going to be two and a half inches on um, right here and of course the height on the buckle is going to be inch and three quarters right there now the belt itself is going to be inch and three eighths wide right there and let me go ahead and zoom in and of course this is going to be their small line which their small line is going to be 28 by 32 or you could get their medium which is going to be 32 by 36 they also have a large which is going to be 37 by all the way to 40 and an extra large which is 37 or i'm sorry which is 41 to 51 and their double xl which is going to reach 51 to 60 inches now the cool thing about it and the reason why i wanted to see as you can see there is no track system there is no holes on it they're going to have a patent buckle right here which is let me go ahead and as you can see it's magnets and a hook right there so all you do is just just put it on there right there and you heard the little click and it's just going to latch so right there and it just latches so you just adjust the size that you need it for and as you can see the buckle is not gonna come off for nothing and unless you just pull it right back to the side and of course it'll loosen up it has some little hinges right there which they loop and catch right there and then you're gonna have the magnet right there where it just latches on and catches again it does have a little bit of play but uh groove life uh features that it's going to be that way you're nice and comfortable during work but it's not gonna let your uh pants fall down now of course i'm gonna go ahead and try this out and that was probably the reason that i picked it up just to see what it was about and put it up to the trades so with that being said guys a uh, few messages that's going to conclude the video but again we have reached 4,000 subscribers and we are about to reach 5,000 subscribers before you know it and of course every 1,000 subscribers I end up giving a, away a Vito Pro Pack tech pack now in order to win that guys please you have to comment you have to be active and i have to see your comments down below on my videos or on instagram and that's my way of seeing who's being active and who is uh staying tuned to the channel and going from there so with that being said guys thank you all for the support and thanks for watching one tool a week guys <laughs>